So this will be a video to explain how to enable Weave Spiral. First, you'll, you'll program your weld, and the cursor will be at the beginning of the weld, right underneath the arc on. You'll go up to window to the menu bar and hit add command, and then you'll go down to any of these menus. We'll try it, we'll do flow. And then you'll go down, select a random command, and then that enables you to switch to toggle between the menus here. So you go to the drop down right there, and then you scroll down to move assist. And then you need to go up here and select Excel so that you can select another command. And then you'll select Weave Spiral On, and you will use Weave Spiral Off at the end of your, each of your welds. So you'll, you'll do that at the, at the arc off. So now we'll select Weave Spiral On, and it brings up this menu. Um, this is a lot more user-friendly than the Move LW command that you learned earlier in this assignment. Um, you have frequency here that controls how often it completes a cycle of your weave. Um, front ratio and back ratio is just a um, how they explain how far forward each cycle is and how far backward it is of a, in a percentage. And you'll notice that as you adjust these numbers, that this circle will change. So the front ratio will, will come closer. So we'll leave it at 50, the default. And the left radius, it, you'll notice as you adjust, will adjust how far the, the cycle goes to the left and vice versa for the right radius. So we'll leave that back yeah. at the default. And left angle is pretty much the same thing. We'll leave that at the default of one. And start direct just uh, helps you to um, establish which way you want the cycle to start. So for a weave spiral, it's doing a circular motion. So it's going to be weaving counterclockwise. If you select right, then it will, it will weave clockwise. Um, oops. So let me go back to that. And then uh, direction of amplitude weave, you have sync tool and at point. Um, I haven't noticed any differences between those two selections. I don't quite know what that means, to be honest. So you'll hit enter, and then that will bring up this weave spiral on command with all of your adjustments. And you'll program your weld, and then you'll hit weave spiral off at the end of your weld.